Let's look at this question. Add the third parallel line to help find angle ABC in the diagram. So if I want to find angle ABC, I have to have a look at the relationship between the unknown angle and uh, the angles you are given. So 50 and 70. So according to the information you are given, 50. And we can see we want to use this angle. So I highlight this angle here. So we want to use 50 to find out angle ABC. Okay, so if I draw the angle like that, and then we can see angle 50, this 50 degree angle and angle ABC, they are alternate angle. But if I want to prove they are equal, and we have to find parallel lines, but here, you don't have parallel lines. In this case, I can draw a parallel line. Okay, so we draw a parallel line. C. Okay, draw line C, which is parallel to A and parallel to B. In this case, we can have the Z shape. So this is the Z shape from here to here. And here, so that's a Z shape. And then alternate angles are formed. So this angle and angle one. So I label angle one here. And we know if they are parallel and they are equal. So we can write draw line C making A is parallel to B is parallel to C. So this is what we did. We just uh, wrote what we have done okay because C was not given so you have to write how did you get C so you draw the line okay and then after you draw the line and making A is parallel to C so we have angle 1 equals 50 degree because lines are parallel alternate angles are equal but you didn't write because line are parallel so you have to write the sentence, the reason, because A is parallel to C. You make that. Therefore, angle 1 equals 50 degree. Okay, so if I know angle 1, so angle 2 will be easier. Because angle 2 and 70, they are all still the alternate angles. And then we write because B is parallel to C. You make them parallel. And then, therefore, angle 2 equals 70 degree. The same reason. Lines are parallel. Alternate angles are equal. So the reason why we found angle 1 and angle 2 is if we know angle 1 and angle 2, angle A, B, C is the sum of these two angles. So that will be easier. Therefore, angle A, B, C equals 50 plus 70 equals 120 degree. So when we solve any questions, if you cannot find the answer straight away, normally we want to add something and to make the theorem work.